we show up, we meet this guy over here. He's gonna be helping us out today, showing us some reads and whatnot. And he, he introduced himself, he says, Garrett. I was like, wait, huh? This, yeah. this is like one of the first times this has ever happened. Look at this. Wow. Yeah. So this is gonna be a fun day today. We are out here at Dive Preserve. As you guys already know, based off of that voiceover intro today, we are starting on the front nine, hole number one, par five, pretty straight away. Since I won the, no. No, I won. Well, you did. I won. Last no, you did, actually. So right. if you guys don't remember our best match we ever had was last Saturday. I was three up with four to play and Grant ended up playing the last three holes four under par and beating yep. me. That's best finish probably on my life, so. So Grant does have honors here, driver in hand, par five, like we said. I love this course. I gotta say, this course is absolutely amazing. We've been on some special courses so far in Florida. This has gotta be up there for potentially yeah. the best one. Heads up, Ryder. Yeah, Ryder, heads up. Ryder just risks his life for those angles, man. Anyway. He has been striping it oh. in his hometown. We go to Kansas City, I stripe it well. We go to Florida, you stripe it well. Yeah, it's just some back rows. Outfit's looking clean. See, I wore that shirt, but I wore it with baby blue shorts. I think it looks better like that. We need to start doing like outfit checks. Okay. Well, that's OB, isn't it? Over Local there. Local rules too off first. What's that? Local, Local rules? rules? Oh boy. I'll hit a provisional, but that's not what you like to see. I got some catching up to do in these Saturday matches, so I gotta take what I can get. Nice. Alright, well, two pretty bad swings. Hey, we could still make, well technically we could still make par from there. Three, four, get up and down for par. Par five, we're good. We're good. Garrett hit that first shot. He hit it down the left. In my mind, I already know he's making par. So I haven't even like, well, I'm not even worked up. Cause somehow it's gonna bounce back somewhat into play. We're gonna find it and you're gonna make if a If I part. find that ball, I'm making birdie. So that's what I'm saying. Oh, there's your ball right there. Where? Right there. Oh my goodness. I don't have he much of a swing. You gotta admit though, Grant, I don't have much of a swing here. Yeah, he can't good. lose a ball, folks. The balls love him. He puts like some magnet in them. I got a magnet in my balls. So and he's always eating. I think I'm gonna have to take an unplayable now. How far do we have from it? Like 300 probably. Three plus. 305. Oh. Okay. That was good. Dude, that messes with your brain so much when, when you, you have something in your backswing. Oh, like, yeah. It, like makes you. I'll just go ahead and hit. Grant. We're right next to each other. Oh, yeah. You've just now made it to my drive. It's okay. Dude. Well, I'm gonna stick to my game plan. I'm gonna lay up here. I know that probably doesn't sound good to you guys, but I'm still tight. We just got out of the car. I'm not fully warmed up and I don't feel confident to hit a three wood off the deck yet from 300 yards. So I'm gonna play this as a three shot hole. Garrett obviously can two putt now for his par, but I'm just gonna lay up here with a six iron. Is this you? No. I'm I was not. about to say, you laid it this far back. No, that's probably range. Oh, wow. That, okay. That's kind of weird that you laid up. Yeah. I don't know if that was the play. No. I told them what I what I was feeling. I just was not feeling free with 300 yards off the deck. Hey, I got a birdie left though. What was the yardage here? 95. Garrett? 95. Where's the wind at? Do we know? Wind should be down a little bit. Down out of the right. I mean, you only need 90. One thing I noticed about Garrett though is when you make a mistake, you don't usually compound it with another mistake. You like clutch up and you do that with a three wood. I'm a scrambler. That's that's, that's just that's what I am. That's the difference. See, if you hit a bad tee shot and then you do hit another bad shot, that's when the when the big numbers come into play. Grant is in prime position here to potentially take it to one up. Oh. Wow, good ball there. Got a good luck. About six inches outside of the hole. Let it just come in there. Here we go. Little slow. That was the perfect line. You had the line. Hey, I rolled that right on my line. It was just a little slower than I expected. Kind of pounded that and it's still a little short. Grant here just, I'm just inside of Grant here. One thing I'm gonna do today, I'm gonna tell you guys right now. I'm gonna try and keep my head down on every putt and not look up and come up out of my posture. I'm gonna try and extend down the line and commit to every putt today. Yeah. I tried to commit. I felt like I extended down the line on my stroke. It just maybe like didn't that. play enough break. There's no pictures on the scorecard, that's what they say, right? And <laughs> there's only videos <laughs> for me. <laughs> that was a crazy par. Having to barely kind of chip it out in the fairway and 
get one on the green from 290. Feels good to tie this hole. Last time we played tie, Dive Preserve, I hit it in the trees left and made birdie on Grant. Won this hole, so. I kind of like scrambling on that hole. It's just my hole. Right. I, like I mean, what did you expect, Grant? I, I, what did I say in the beginning? I said it in the beginning. I knew I'd probably have to make birdie. I did not hit a good putt there. You gotta make those. You can't. I mean, I had the hole. You just gotta make a putt. For me, that's, that's a huge confidence booster, being able to make that putt. Going to hole two, all square. All right, this is not a driver hole like, I got driver. at all. Yeah, I saw that. I'm trying to say that. All right, guys, this is not a driver hole whatsoever. I mean, if you hit a driver, you're absolutely crazy. I'm going to hit a hybrid here and just get it in play. Oh, That's a little pop fly to center field. A little pop fly to center field. Right down the middle of the fairway. I mean, you can't draw it up much better than that. Now, that was perfect. Look at my tee. It's still in the ground. See how perfect that was? It's yeah, actually kind of funny. <laughs> nice shot. Thanks. That was threaded. Great shot. Thanks. You saw the hook on the first hole. That's kind of been the trend of my drives since coming down to Florida, but I think we're figuring it out. What's cool right now is we have a 2v2 coming up right after this map. Right, so we're getting warmed up. We're basically getting warmed up. We're trying to beat each other, but then we're going to be on the same team. So we have to switch. Right. Completely. I just need to finish this pull away. Go with the pitching wedge here, guys. Garrett is way up there. He's got a little flip wedge in. I'll be good, please. Perfect. I'll take that all day. Garrett's saying 52. We don't have too much green to work with, so we're just going to kind of open it up here. I almost try and spin one in there. The greens seem to be pretty soft, so. If I can make birdie here, put the pressure on Grant, it'd be huge. Maybe take it to one up through two. Stand for me, stand for me. Okay, a little too much on that one. Hopefully we can knock that in though. Here we go guys, Garrett and I, pretty close to the same length. I'm a little farther out, a lot of left to right. That was it, that was it. I will take that all day, hit it on my line. Came in on the high side, just. I kind of pushed that one. All square after the first two holes. That was a pretty standard hole there. We both made par, but in that first hole, it's just crazy. It's just, I say this every match, but Garrett, it's like his short game, his putts, his ability to get out of trouble. It's like no one I've ever seen. Grant still has honors, so this is a pretty big advantage for me. Down the wind, I get to see kind of what he does here. Try and dial it in after. Grant's going with an eight. See if I can feed it in there. I do know this green how there's like a big ridge, yeah. so I'm gonna try and funnel it. He might have made. Well, it. I'm going right at it. Great shot. Uh. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, but we're right next to it. Tried to hit a little bit of the right. <laughs> that was playing short too. Oh my goodness, that's gonna be right next to mine. Oh, it's just sh dude. <laughs> Holy. I will say though, I think Grant is pretty in for birdie. He's in there pretty tight. Fortunately, I think I'm a bit short, but see if we make it for birdie. Dude, these Saturday matches playing out at courses like this just makes me so, feels amazing. Because no one's out here. Truly a beautiful place. It is. Grateful, man. Very grateful. Holy. I'm sorry, Grant. I just, it's a little outside the zone, though. Yeah, because of yesterday. Well, we it's saw him miss one this length yesterday, so we just, oh, dude. one of those things. Oh. Can't do it. Just can't do it. Garrett has given me a perfect read twice in a row. Last hole, I kind of pushed it, so if he, he gives me this read and I hit the line, I think it's going to go in. A little right to left. Not much, though. Come on. No. Oh. Garrett is automatic. Let me tell you. He just sees the line. I hit it in the hole. Yeah. Thank you. One under to one under through three, on to hole number four, par Dude, four, tougher mentally, hole. Like I missed one of those yesterday. I used that, that, now that range is like really short, but I did miss one yesterday. So that one I was just, like, if you miss one of those, you're gonna think about the putt you missed the day before. You are. Grand going for a cut here for the first time ever. That is so good. Wow. Hey, that's what I need to see in the 2v2, just not right now. Trying to take a little little left of that with a little more cut. Nice. Perfect. Can't go through it. 
Should be good there. Kind of pulled a little bit. We'll take it. All right, 132. I am through. It's not great, but it's it shouldn't be too hard of a shot. I feel like I can hook this around the tree pretty easy. That. Ah. Uh, think I'm putting. A little too much hook and a little too much speed, but let's see if we can make it. 132 here, guys. I'm gonna hit a full pitching wedge. I did not think I could hit that long. Dang, we'll take it. I did not think the screen was this big, but I'm happy we got a putt. It's straight into the grain, down grain, and kind of flattens out at the end. It's gonna be tricky. Thank you. Outside right a little bit. I like that. No way. No way that did not turn left. Wow, it straightened out crazy. Still all square through four holes. Both are one under par. We are on to a par four that's actually drivable, and I'm definitely gonna be going for it. Wind's gonna be off the right a little in two. See if we can knock one on the green. Wow, this next hole is it's almost either way up or three wood. Total is 273. I think I'm gonna go three wood here. Grant is going three wood. He's kind of laying up here. Nice. It. It's good though. Right down the middle. Oh. No. I'd like my misses to look like that though. Chunked yeah. it 250 down the middle. Perfect. Yep. Oh my goodness. No, Hold on. Oh no. No. I thought for sure that was gonna be good. I look up. The wind's just taking a little too far left. Hopefully we can we can find it. If we can find it, we can play it. I thought right when you hit it, it was perfect. Oh yeah. Sorry, right at the pin. I was thinking this is money. I That's a stupid gonna mistake. Be I think it's still gonna be up though. I think the play was definitely to aim more at where Grant was. Here on this find ball. your highlighter ball though. I oh yeah. I mean that thing be shining. Let me tell you. That thing does not go anywhere. This is the world's smallest fairway, and I just missed it. I can go under this so easy. So that's one thing. I gotta read this lie. I knew that was gonna happen. That's that backyard Florida grass. This is an older ball, someone else hit this. Well, I mean, what are the odds of that, guys? I found a green Pro V1 in the marsh, exactly where I hit it, and it's not my ball. I'm gonna have to drop like way back there. Yeah, this is probably where it last crossed because it was a nice draw on this line and it didn't cross all the way up there, unfortunately. 95 yards, gotta get it up and down for far. Ooh, kind of spun a little bit there. I can still make a putt. Here we go, guys. We got a birdie putt. Oh, I, that's exactly where I have it. It's a weird putt here because there's like a giant hill just to the left of the pen. So I'm going to bank it off of that. Oh, a little testy there from Grant. This this is not looking good for him. How much do you see in this? Pretty good amount, huh? I like he pulls his glasses down and gets the full on read. Our brains are on the same wavelength. Oh! No way. Nice putt. Thank you. We won a hole. That is so rare to win it with a par, but I feel like I've been hitting the ball so good today. It feels good to finally break through, get one up. Par five here, hole number six, straight away. Kind of a tight fairway, actually. Grant's going with the big D stick here. One handed in the fairway. There, Not far off though. Should I just play that cut today? I feel like, I feel like maybe I should just play that because that feels comfortable. Sometimes you just gotta get a comfortable shot that's working any given day. All right, well, well I never saw yours. I never saw yours. But I didn't do it. Okay guys, well this is what we're looking at. We are up against a tree. I'm just gonna punch it back into the fairway here. I'm grateful to have a swing. That could have been a lot worse. At least I can make contact there, but I'm gonna have a long ways in. I don't have much here. These these trees, they decided to grow like right next to each other, which kind of sucks, but I got a tiny gap here. I'm going with the six iron. This is just kind of one of those you hit and hope. We did it. You just gotta hit and hope, Ryder. 
Hit and hope. When I hit a shot like that, I feel like Phil Nichols said. Being Phil would be the most stressful job in the world. That's kind of how I play golf. Yeah. Not bad at all. I thought I was going to have like 200 in. How far? 152. That left. Probably a little left. Yeah. Kind of a blind shot here. It is a blind shot. Not kind of. Oh my goodness, that was good. That might need to go actually, it's gonna spin. We'll see, that might be short. I think I spun it. I thought I missed the green for sure, but I got lucky here. Just caught the left side. Right, that was a good stroke there. That's the worst. You hit a putt and you you know it's just it has zero chance as soon as you hit it because you know you just didn't make a good stroke. But on to hole number seven. I'm currently one down. Got to make something happen. All right, 175 here. Pin's pretty much in the middle, I hear. It's a little down off the left, I believe. Grant here. Got a little seven piece. I like that. It's a nice one. 175 is a good little seven iron for me. Yeah. No. Why am I... The wind is also going that way. I got a little eight iron here. Ah, uh, not a great swing. Might be short of it. No, nope. long of it. Hit it pretty well, just unfortunately not a great swing there. Two pretty poor swings actually. Now we're struggling to get pars from over there on the right side. Those are not mistakes you want to make there. Pretty easy par three. You're in the water. Twelve. Huh? I am in the water, but there's no water. You know, shout out to whoa. Holy! <laughs> oh, he didn't really take that one through. Could be bad. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna get to my ball. Here we go. I'm going. Okay, that was not bad at all. <laughs> and the shirt stayed clean. It went in my mouth. How did it not get on my shirt, but it goes in my mouth? Oh, there it is. I guess I'm cleaning up to do. This is a tiny bunker. This has to be one of the smallest bunkers I've ever been in. Pretty straightforward shot. Hopefully, you can put one close. Kind of jumped on me there. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to make a pretty long putt here for the par. And for me to win this hole, I, I have to assume I got to make this. Grant is most likely gonna get up and down for bogey. One down, I need to make something happen here. I'm going for the chip in here. I wanna put some pressure on Garrett, that should be kinda cool. I won't even be mad if this goes in. No. Shot. I pulled that. Dude. Woo! Two double bogeys there on that par three. That is the last thing I would have expected from those positions we were in. <laughs> Golf's hard, man. Golf. Well, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Full three wood here. Gotta make something happen. One down, two to play. Birdie, birdie, finish. Let's go. And then if I'm gonna, if it's 115, then I'm gonna hit a 50 degree. Just win this hole and we're good. That's all I gotta do. Oh. Oh no. Um. Uh, what? Just happened. Oh, we're good. We're alive. Ryder's recording it. Wow. That stuff grabs your club. You gotta yeah. like swing extra hard. I mean, I can't even use that as an excuse. That was just a bad shot. <laughs> Truly a bad shot right there. Okay, you know. Now I gotta see if I can even get this on the green. I'll take that. I'll take that. We got a putt for bogey. I think Garrett's going to two putt though. It's probably going to probably not going to be good this hole. We see about a cup of right to left here. That's a bad putt. We got a chance here. Is it like left edge? Dude, there's just a play. On to the last. It's all square. 
hole number nine, the final hole. If we were to tie, we have to go into a playoff. I don't know, this has been kind of, kind of a pillow fight and it's kind of gone downhill. So see if we can dial it in here. Par four here. How far is this hole? It's pretty long, huh? A little hefty. Four, probably 410 from here. Have a wedge in if you hit a solid tee shot here. Good swing. That was really good. Thank you. I'm not gonna lie, I hit that one really good. I could not hit it any better, so. Full square, last hole. Well. Wow. Get a ride. Garrett and I, yeah, we just talked, like, remember the other day, I was like, golf is so weird, because you literally just, golf is so weird, because you literally just swing a club. It Whoa! is such a weird concept, and the fact that we just do it for fun, yeah, and enjoy it is crazy. You just have a club in your hand and a ball goes through the air. And then you're a human at the same time, so that means you're not perfect. And you're gonna hit bad shots. <laughs> and you're not a robot, so you're gonna hit awful you're, shots. You're gonna get really frustrated. Golf is a very weird game. Both of us are in the middle of the fairway. Grant, I, I think I got him by about, about 30. Um, Probably did. Both prime position. So hopefully get one of these up and down, or both of them up and down for birdie. I mean, this, there's no excuses if you make par from here. I got a 56 degree, it's 110 pin, 100 to the front. Got to birdie this. best not bad though 88 yards stock 80 downwind trying to kind of one one hopper and then stop and and jump oh my I'm leaving these wedge shots short today that's unfortunate if we want a winner on this hole we're gonna have to have one of us make one of these putts I haven't made a putt today so I think this is gonna go in Why am I doing this to myself? Leaving the wedges short and killing my pot. Holy. Inside, inside right? Okay. Yeah. Inside right? I pushed it. I pushed it. I... My pot. Nice. I needed that to extend the mat. That was a good little match on the front nine. So what we're going to do now, we're going to do a playoff hole for this video, but we're about to film a 2v2. Uh, we're going to start that 2v2 on the back nine. And then after we finish the 2v2, we're going to come out here and do a playoff, which you're going to see in about five seconds. On oh to gosh. the first playoff hole here. Flip a tee. Yep. Hole number one. We're going back to hole number one. No, flip it actually. Oh. Alright, it's me. Oh, it's we are racing the storm. We got this. Shoot. This is our last hole. We have literally beat this storm like crazy. We, we filmed the Saturday match and we filmed an 18 hole 2v2, which stay tuned if it's not already up. Now, here we are. Hard. Oh, I have to play as a three shot hole. For me, I think for me, this is almost a three shot hole every time. Oh, oh no. no. Grant, that was on the toes, that was quick over the top. Oh no. That might be OB. No, there's no OB. There's no OB? Nope. And I got a green ball, so even if I'm in the range, we're gonna find it. All right, guys, I'm just gonna punch this back into play. I have absolutely nothing. I don't know what Garrett's doing. I think he's going up over the trees, but just getting it back in play here. We're probably gonna have like 200 and 180 from there, something like that. You're going up over these trees. Yeah, and at 58, here we go, boys. It's good. Oh, rider, it's right at you. Huh. Middle of the fairway, perfect. I didn't know how far I was going. We will take that. I just swung as hard as I could at a 58. That was cool. 175? All right, Grant. A shorter. I'm gonna hit a seven iron. I think it's going a little shorter today. The air is just really heavy. Is that good? All right, 142 here. I got a little pitching wedge. I'm trying to play this one a little bit off the right. A little draw. Oh no. Went straight. Okay. Alright. Not bailed. too good. Not too good. Kind of bailed out right, but I think I'm going to make a long putt. I, don't, I think I am, Grant. Alright. Alright, Grant here just uh, short of the green. He's got his little wedge. He didn't even bring a putter. I like that. Oh boy. This is to win the match right here. This is going to go in right here. I'm feeling it. 
push it and just did not give it a confident stroke. It was the line. All right, Grant was a little testy. Hey, dude, I've done that a lot. I didn't even hit the cuff. Like I, and it, what was crazy is you can watch it in slow mo. I rolled that end over end. I was just an idiot. I thought that went left for some stupid reason. So that was that was just a mystery right there. That's just dumb. Yeah, that takes me to three down now in the Saturday matches. Mm. That stings. That stings. We're getting closer. We're getting closer to making that. We're getting really close to bringing it back to all square. Cause that's my goal right now. And that's crazy. You were six down at one point. Yeah. So now you're really starting to make a comeback. I can't be letting that happen. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Once again, shout out to Garrett. Pleasure. He's a freaking Thank beast today. Legend. He gave us all the right reads. He was, he was killing it out there today. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, stay tuned for more content. You do not want to miss the 2v2. That's it. That's all I'm going to say. If it's not on the channel, stay tuned. We will say it is the second greatest golf shot in the history of YouTube. Under Matt's hole in one on a par four. Stay tuned. Peace out.